Mama Scott, man. To me, what she be doing and bringing her people together, I love that because that's more numbers. That's you posting and that's you doing a video with this person. I feel like if East Texas did that, for sure, we would have a way better push. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. Yeah. I, wanna, I wanna ask you, like, you did a Say Cheese interview right. before you had left. Uh, you Have you heard from Sean or any, anybody? Man, I done talked to Sean on Instagram maybe like once, but as far as just hearing from him, like it's been a while. It's been like Sean been on Boss Talk 101. Yeah. I think I asked him last time he was here. Uh, he was just here, wasn't he, a few months ago, and I was like, will you, do you take interest in East Texas artists? You know, I always ask, brother. Man, you they, don't, they don't mess with East Texas like that. And it ain't nothing against Sean. It ain't nothing against him. But I'm just saying, like, I just feel like, when you say they, who is they? Just all the bloggers or not even? No, no, nah, nah, hell no, nah. not all the just, bloggers. Well, who? More so, let's say this: the people in position who could shine light on East Texas, they don't really mess with East Texas. Let me say that. And when I say in position, I mean the ones where these labels most likely are looking at. They looking at who's the hottest places. You know what I'm saying? And, and you know they looking at artists who's hotter. Maybe let's say that. But you know East Texas got a lot of talent. I just feel like we just don't. First of all, we ain't coming together like we supposed to. That, that is what it is. You know what I'm saying? We came together like uh, the DFW artists and the Houston artists. I feel like we could have a bigger motion. It's more so a thing with this. Ah, oh, they from over here. They from over here. We don't really mess with them. Well, I just feel like Mama Scott, man. To me, what she be doing and bringing her people together, I love that because that's more numbers. That's you posting and that's you doing a video with this person. I feel like if East Texas did that, for sure, we would have a way better push, Do you, Mama a better Scott, chance. So you saying you agree with her when she went out and got the features from T.I. Sauce Walker, when she went out and got the features from, and the way she did the, the uh, Fast Bash, or the way she operated in Fast E&T, um, that, that part, what so, do you, when no, you say Mama Scott, what do you mean? I like when she, Mama Scott don't mind linking up. That's what I mean. Mama, Mama Scott don't mind bringing artists together. Let me say that. Far as for me, she ain't never tripped. If I call her and I need something, need something done. Like far as like, hey, okay, I had a situation with um, the Big X. I needed one of my songs cleared. She didn't mind just picking up the phone and trying to get that handled. Like, but I'm, all I'm saying is, she don't mind coming together, like to help each other. Like, if I want to do, if I want to link up with her, her label, like or. Her people, you know what I'm saying? She don't mind putting it together. She don't mind putting stuff together. That's all I'm saying. Like, and I feel like as, as artists in East Texas, like maybe we just don't feel like, oh, he ain't hot enough or he ain't hot enough to work with. I feel like, man, if we just linked up more and just got in a studio together and worked and just build, that light will come on us. And we man. can't we can't expect everybody to put the shit on us. We got to do it ourselves. Mama At the end of the day, that's all I'm Mama saying. Mama Scott is dope. I, I watched her. I didn't want to meet her at first. She'll tell you that. I, yeah. She run around here, she old out here, yeah. running around here dancing with the young niggas. Yeah, I'ma pop my shit, I'ma talk my shit, these hoes ain't seen no sauce like this. It's on the video, yeah. I seen her. Yeah, that's a whole bunch of checks, boy. Me and Mama Ruth, ride around Tyler. And I was like, hell no, I yeah. don't want to talk to that woman because right. she is crazy. Right, right, right. I know when I saying. met her, I fell in love with the fact that she loved the people so much. And she loved the people. And she'll spend all her money trying to help everybody to do whatever. That's the way she was. And I didn't know that about her That first. woman do it for free, bro. She'll do anything for everybody. And that's why I respect her. And, I, you know, she just dope when it comes down to that aspect of it. Now, the part about, you know, I be on her about making sure not to let people misuse you. Because you do so much, how do we turn this to a ROI? No, for sure. And I've been on it from the day Return she walked on in that door. Return on it. Ever since you, you know how I am. You already know what yeah. I told. Her. Well, yeah. how we win? How we recouping? Well, how we, you know, that's how I be looking at it. Yeah, yeah. What well, you talking about spending all the money? Go, I, I can't. I, I don't know if I. No, 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 I don't no, no. But she, she, but she's just the type of person that she'll give her all. Yeah. And ain't nothing wrong with it. But I'm always trying to find a way to get it back. Shit, who you telling? You know every, every feature I'm gonna do, like I'm gonna try to see, like, hey, am I gonna make money off this? Cause like I ain't just doing features. If I gotta pay somebody, it gotta make sense. Like, well, she came on the show and told about all these stories, so it ain't something that she didn't. It was people that got over on it. One person for seventy five hundred, another for two of them for fifteen hundred. Yeah, you know, so she's very open about that. But yeah. that wouldn't happen if she had a better, and you, you know, go situation as an artist. And as an artist too, you go through it, and you know. 
Is yeah, but you're right though. You yeah. gotta handle that business first. First, and and, and, and that's and, big. And that's what I done learned. That <laughs> business is first. That paperwork is first. That's like, it. Like yeah, wasn't it first when you came here? Like when I walked in here. <laughs> so look, that, but I get it. I get it. I really just shoot. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Messing with you about it, but yeah, I respect that. Yeah, I man. respect it, man. That business come first, man, and, and you know that it is what it is, but. Man, if we had more of her, let me say that. If we had more that was pushing a line that's trying to get stuff done, I just feel like it'll be, it'll be, it'll be something. But we all are in, I ain't going to even say competition. It's more so like, nah, I don't mess with them because of this. I don't like this because of what they said or, or because they so confident. And well, a lot of people don't cut balls talk off, but. I, I never heard of that. Oh, it happens. But I'm saying I never But at that. the end of the day, they cut them off too soon. I'm I feel that. <laughs> Nah, I feel that. Nah, you, you, you really don't. You, it's hard because at the end of the day, I still love everybody. A lot of people do that, but at the end of the day, they can always come home. They can yeah. always. I ain't the type of nigga that ain't gonna let them come home. You understand yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. They can always come pull up, and we can always get it going. Put these cameras on them again. Nah, for sure. But you know. Yeah, we on boss talk one on one. Yeah, we gonna talk.